Hello, my friend I and welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin Anwin for anyone who's new here and let's get back into eco lifestyle. Don't know what happened to my voice then. I give up. I probably would have <laughs> redone that at one point, but I'll be all right. So Pofty's just taking care of her plants. We're starting with Pofty today. Pofty's all on her own with just Robo Key, so she's just confiding in all of her problems. <laughs> She's saying no to cars and Robokey's saying yes. Okay, but she needs a little bit of fun. So we could just play with Robokey. And I don't want to spoil anything for like anyone who hasn't watched Sims Sparked, but this is actually, uh, but it's been out a little while and I think the second episode is out for America now. But yeah, this was actually built by Simproved and Blossom and Mary were created by, I'm guessing Simproved too, but she's definitely built this. Uh, but Plumbella and the English Simmer created Blossom and Mary and I was always kind of like questioning why I didn't want to renovate this lot here and I wanted to renovate everything else in this whole world and that is because this was built by a simmer. How cool is that? Popty has been promoted to construction technician. She has received a cash bonus, atomized mist, which I have no idea what that is. <laughs> Uh, and she needs to use eco upgrade parts for that and succulent earrings. Oh, they've got to be cute. She can't actually wear earrings though. Never mind. So what does she need to do for work today? We'll get work out of the way first. She needs to draft a concept and perform a handiness or eco parts upgrade. We do have 900 simoleons, that's not bad. So she's going to draft a concept while she's waiting to see whether honey fizzes nicely. I've got, it's got to be nice, right? Or really, really gross. So we can watch this and she does need some fun. So maybe we'll watch the TV season premiere. She needs to cheer herself up a little bit. She's done a little bit of her work. She can maybe watch the season premiere so when she goes out somewhere they're not gonna spoil the ending for her <laughs> like i just did with sim sparked hey it's been out more than a week and it's, it's on youtube now if i've watched it i'm guessing everyone has i'm not gonna talk too much about like everything that went on in it i just kind of spoiled who got their sims in let's just say i'd rather the sims not have too much drama as like this let's play is going it is extremely drama filled but <laughs> i definitely didn't plan that <laughs> i was i did not start this let's play thinking that i have to divorce my sims but i'm sort of hoping i'm not gonna have to in the end I don't think you can upgrade the recycling machine, can you? Oh, you can. <gasps> oh, instant mash filter. I don't know what that does. We could give it a go and hope that that takes off. And then we finished our work for today. Is it done? <gasps> oh, it's ready. Oh, honey pop. That's an odd one. I don't think I've ever seen anyone try that. I have seen people try it and fizz the trash fruit though and the the meat cubes and that just sounds really gross. Um, Popty, you're gonna have to feed Robokey after that because she is having a good old buff at the... What was I just saying about no drama? And... Who's at our door? Sims, what are you doing? What are you doing to me? Uh, I wanted to give that honey pop to you, Brody. Oh, oh no. Um, uh, invite in. Uh, hi. <laughs> I thought you were uh, with Ira for a little while. Are you okay? It's like, oh, I've uh, changed the house a little bit. <laughs> and I got this fizzing machine. And I just tried to fizz some honey. She's just like trying to fill in like this awkward silence. Oh, this looks really cool. Give a romantic gift. 
because we we all try to make it up to him slowly so maybe our sweet paw will make it up to him a little bit oh. Oh. <laughs> hey look there oh our hearts did go up and it looks like he's giving us a gift oh this is so so nice maybe this is working and he gave us a flower back we love gardening look how much our romance our bad romance has gone down ah that's that's pretty good uh sh he really loved our sweet pop huh still a casual discussion but i kind of want to leave it a little autonomous to see what they do she's probably like oh are we are we getting rid of the drama this quickly i thought this would be really bad but the sweet pop worked <laughs> yay the sweet pop worked Look at our little beans! They're making it up to each other. Oh yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't cope last episode. It was just too sad. But this is this is okay. I think. Oh yeah, he's going home now. Oh, I'm pretty happy with that. I wasn't expecting that. I just thought, oh, I'll just give him a gift because we gave him a candle last episode, and that didn't really do much. They won't evolve. Maybe it's the vertical planter, I don't know. But she needs to grow a cow plant and <laughs> the cow plants can now be named in The Sims. <laughs> so daft. So I'd like to go over to Oasis Springs and see if we can fish out a cow plant. Right, I think this one's the cow plant spot. Oh, we can gather water too. We don't need to. I think this is the cow plant spot anyway and oh look at that the oasis springs is actually a green neighborhood huh so let's just leave the robot fishing for a while until her needs are absolutely terrible and let's just hope i get a cow plant oh first thing we caught it took us all of an hour we got a cow plant berry let's go home so here's our cow plant berry and we can pop that in there and we can plant our cow plant <laughs> hilarious i love it all of the cow plants are called little sim z now <laughs> for little sim z i love it so i'm gonna leave mine as little sim z at the moment <laughs> But yeah, that's what I wanted to do, show you. I just can't believe we just got one so quickly. Okay, so it is the next day and we are with Brody and Ira now. And as you can see, Brody's feeling in a lot better mood today than he was last week. Or the day before. He didn't really like never really know whether to keep to sims time or real life time <laughs> what would you rather <laughs> so i was probably like you forgave it already and he's just gonna talk about that juice fizzing and be like look i kind of understand she didn't really do anything it was definitely alicia and i was like yeah i i did see that <laughs> and I couldn't really believe it either so I, I guess you're right <laughs> it wasn't really Popty was it and he was like no it was definitely Alicia like Alicia came out of nowhere you were just chatting with you were just chatting with uh, Popty and everything was fine and then Alicia came over and ruined everything but what I'd like to do in this neighborhood is stop the It's called sharing is caring thing because that drove me a little bit mad so let's petition to repeal collect enough signatures before the voting period ends to ensure the successful repeal of this enacted oh okay so we need signatures sharing is caring is annoying please help me <laughs> Yanabi. Sunaka. Did we get one? We got one! Nice! So I see someone by here and we're gonna have to give them a cheerful introduction. can't believe Ira's doing the petitions. She's the one talking to people. 
And we need to ask for a repeal signature from Maya. I hope it's Maya. Can you please sign this signature? It's absolutely destroying this makerspace. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Is there anyone else in here? Is there anyone else going to be coming? Because oh, I'm going to have to fix it again, aren't I? Let's get a gig. Any candle stuff? Fabrication. Fabrication. Candles? Level 7? We have any level 7 now? Oh, okay, we're not making any candles. We're making lamps. How are we doing? Two out of five. Let's see if we can get this done today. We need to ask Tina. Tina's obviously going to want to save the maker's face. She's feeling super confident about getting support and Blossom! Now, I kind of wanted to run by something. I'm probably still going to do it anyway. I'd really like to explore the knitting pack that is coming out today when I post this at some point, I think. And I'd really like to uh, explore the knitting pack with Blossom and Mary. We got five out of five signatures! We're saving the maker space! Yay! Let's get rid of sharing is caring. We did it. With my socially anxious sim. So she's going to be feeling very confident from getting five signatures. And she's going to go over and yell at Alicia and tell her to get out of her face. Right, stop talking to these people. Yell at her. And what else can we do? Swear at her. Like seriously, go away. Go away. Just start yelling at Alicia and she's just flirting with what is going on Alicia you're flirting with everyone and insult her I definitely didn't play her like this like what is going on Alicia why are you no I, I was definitely go going to be telling her how much she ruined Brody's life and Poppy's life, like, she really got in uh, the middle of a really good relationship and totally ruined everything. You ruined my relationship. You absolutely destroyed mine and Poppy's relationship and we barely, really got it off the rocks. And you're just going around just playing with everyone now? Like, who are you? You were nothing like who you were in uni. What happened to you in Sulani? And I think they're gonna actually fight. Not that this is ever like the right thing to do, but this is The Sims. And we fixed our relationship with some fizzy pop, so why don't fight with one of our old friends for kissing our wife that was dramatic but there we go we, we finally got like a little bit of like anger out it's not really the best way of doing it but it's the sims i tried some realism but that's fine let's collect some honey for <laughs> for pop D. Let's get rid of some of that like stress and yeah, I was feeling embarrassed about Brody now, I guess. He's doing really well on this fabrication machine now, though. I'm pretty impressed with him. Look how happy he is doing this as well. Like, Brody, maybe it's because he's a little dazed, but Brody usually looks absolutely miserable doing this. Like, usually. But not today. He has really cheered himself up. That honey pop really got him in the romantic mood and really fixed their relationship. That is just hilarious. I, I was 
manage to uh, stop sharing his caring too, which she is such an, an anxious sim. Like, I'm so proud of her. Thought it would be really cool to maybe have a look at the knitting pack. I'm recording this before the pack comes out. Uh, but yeah, on Thursday, instead of Planet Zoo, we're gonna be checking out the little nifty knitting pack with the Blossom and Mary, and it's just gonna be like a little mini let's play with those two knitting some cute things. How are you doing on your skill, Ira? Are you doing any? Oh, she's almost there. She is getting kind of hungry now. Have you finished your lamp? Finished fabrication! Yay, we can go home. <laughs> and I am gonna leave it off there. I'm really glad Brody and Poppy have made it up to each other a little bit in this episode. I can't believe Brody just turned up at the house. I didn't call him over. <laughs> Honestly, I've not been planning any of this. It's been super fun having all of this stuff just happen. We do complain quite a lot with like sims don't really do anything unless you tell them to but these townies have been going wild in evergreen harbor i don't know whether it's mc command center or it's just a bug from all of these uh, neighborhood action plans <laughs> it totally ruined my storyline anyway it's gone on a whole different route but i'm having fun i'm definitely enjoying it last a lot more than last week when everything was sad and they had split up so i'll see you on thursday with blossom and mary greenberg having a little check out of nifty knitting that is going to be like a little mini series planet zoo is going to go i'll pause for a little bit while we check out that series and then on saturday i'll probably be doing a nifty knitting build you know me gotta to check out all of the build mode stuff so if you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and if you haven't already and you would like to, it would mean a lot to me if you could subscribe and hit the bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. I just told you when they were coming, but I do usually post on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!